What is up you guys and welcome to part two of my Nightwing stick videos which is going to be all about finishing and painting these guys right here. I built these last week. You can go and check out that video up on my channel. But I'm ready and I also promised you guys a little bit of a trick. So I'm going to jump right in. I'm going to show you what I'm doing. Let's go. Okay, now first thing that we're going to do to prep these for paint and our little trick that I'm going to be doing here in just a second is we're going to sand these down, get off all of these markings, and get it to a texture where the primer and eventually the paint will stick to it. Now I'm going to go from 220 to 400 grit sandpaper, and I'm also probably going to hit it with this sanding sponge right here. So let's get started. Okay, now I've sanded these down all to a 220 grit and I've hit them with my sanding sponge. Now here is for the trick that I was telling you guys about. I picked this up probably about a year ago now and I'm still using it, but this is a carbon fiber sticker. And basically what I plan to do with this, it's just an auto body decal, is I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna wrap these metal portions in this. And this just is a really cool effect. It gives it more of a mixed media appearance and it just looks kind of badass so i'm gonna sit here figure out these measurements and i'm gonna cut this sticker to shape Okay, and there we go. All of the middle section is wrapped there. There's a couple of little bubbles and stuff, but that can all be taken care of later. And I think now we are ready for priming. Now I've masked off my midsection and I'm just going to be using this gray Rust-Oleum primer. It's a two-in-one primer, so it'll fill and sand. And I just have to prime these things up. Okay, and that looks about good. I've gotten really good coverage on all of my surfaces. And then the next step is just to sand it to 400, and then we're ready for paint. Okay, now I have my sticks sanded and primed. And now I'm going, I'm going to be using an airbrush to paint this, but you could just use any rattle can. And I have two separate paints here. I have this gunmetal, it's just an acrylic paint that I'm going to be thinning with some 91% alcohol. And now I also have this blue sapphire, it's just a metallic blue, that I'm going to be doing some of these bands. And I'm going to go ahead and get all of these done and then I will show you how I'm going to weather this and all that afterwards.
now that I have all of my sticks painted with this nice gunmetal base coat, now I'm going to go and I'm going to start masking up these pieces. And I believe I'm going to take these piece, this piece, and this piece, and I'm going to paint that blue. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. Okay, so I have my sticks masked off. I have my blue paint all mixed up and now I'm just gonna go in lightly and do a couple of th really thin coats on these bands. Okay, now that I have my blue all done, I have mixed up a wash of watered down burnt sienna and black. And this is my weathering process. I'm just gonna go in a couple of different layers and just really dirty up this stick here. Now you can kind of see this process and how it's just putting grime in all of these little areas. And I'm gonna go ahead and start doing this on both sticks and finish up. And then I'll show you guys the end result. All right, here they are you guys, my finished Nightwing sticks. I am super happy with the way that these guys turned out. And it has been an extremely long day trying to get these things finished, but I'm going to be doing a bunch more videos like this. I'm gonna be doing costume breakdowns, hopefully some kind of movie reviews, but stay tuned to this channel, subscribe, share it with your friends, and I'll see you guys around.